Okay, so what we're looking at here is a plantar callus removal and you can see that it's got a central corn. So this, the corn is the central hard section of this callus. Um, so this is a particularly painful area because it's under the second metatarsal head, which is directly in line with the second toe. So you can see that's right where the second metatarsal head would sit. When we stand on the ground, that metatarsal head takes some weight. Uh, and if it takes more than its fair share of weight, we get this little callus formation there. So what we do is we remove the callus cap and then enucleate the corn underneath. So you can see we're just removing that callus cap. So if we think of the corn like an ice cream, so the ice cream is sitting outside the foot and the cone sits inside the foot and the cone is the corn. So then we're basically shaving down, we're into the corn section now. And what that we're actually doing is shaving down as much as we can. You can see it's really quite a wide corn section. So what we do is we enucleate as much as we can, as quickly and easily as we can. And then when we get right down to the pointy section, we'll often use the tip of the scalpel uh, because we can't actually get further down without cutting the living tissue. So then we need to really accurately just cut out that central cone section uh, and then the pressure will be relieved and the pain will be pain relief will be almost instant for the patient. They'll usually walk straight out on this. We don't have to use any anesthetic or anything. Uh, and it will grow back in probably about six to 12 weeks with the average being about eight. Uh, and I hope this helps explain some of the questions.